So, not home yet. Coming from a workout in Chile Moos in Barbados City. Cows on the back. Like, can you guys see that? Anyway, whatever. This is gonna be super low, I think, but I'll try to talk louder and not make people feel that I'm going a bit mental. Yeah. And I'm gonna walk over to where these people are trying to act like they don't know me. We don't know her. But anyway, yeah, so just did a workout, but I'm about to have ice cream. Probably won't have all of it. Probably won't have all of it, but I am going to have some of it. Ashley's in my nightly vlog. Oh, that's but, what um, this is. Yeah. So, I'm gonna eat this, then I'll ta talk more about what happened tonight. Today. Yeah. Leaving Chili Moose finally. Um. I would have done the entire thing here, but I didn't want to be this obnoxious person talking about my day that nobody gives a shit about. Except for you wonderful people who watch me. All two of them. All the time. All two of them, as Joe says. That's all right. Well, I am keep one watching, of them, guys. So. Keep, keep we're watching. Right here, right? Keep watching. Right here. Right here. <laughs> <laughs> keep watching all the time. I like, you know, click it a million times so people think that, you know, it's gone viral. <laughs> But yeah, so when I get home, I will talk a bit more about the day on the whole. But for now, I'm gonna get in the car, which I'm actually missing and not um, getting in. Yeah, yeah I, I almost went from a pretty jovial two seconds ago to being kind of annoyed as all hell in two seconds. Uh, roses and the hormonal hell of them. Anyway, why am I in the bathroom while well, I'm? gonna take a shower now um, but decided to do this right quick and plus the bathroom is quiet and there's no one here quiet except for we have a leaf okay? except for the dripping pipe quiet um, yeah I try really hard not to take out my hormonal shit on people as I've said before so <sighs> deep breaths right deep breaths deep breaths deep breaths deep breaths deep breaths. Anyway, so today I got tons of stuff done, so that's stuff to be happy about. I had some client meh to deal with, but it was sorted thankfully, so that's no problem. Um, I actually worked out twice today. Um, I worked out once with Ashley earlier this afternoon, and then I did a workout at the gymnasium as we do usually on Wednesdays, but we did one today. Um, and that was a good one. Um, as well, they were both mainly cardio, so I feel really good about that. Um, what else? Yeah, but that's been the day more or less. Like a lot of my days are like that. Like it's a lot of work, and when it's not work, it's you know you work out or you know that's it. You get beach days in between. You know, nowadays recently I'm a recent beach person, so yeah. I'm not really beach person, but I do go more now. Um, yeah, my arm hurts. I actually did like some pull-ups and stuff, so my arms are like ah. Um, but yeah, I I know there's some people out there who are probably gonna be like, oh whatever. Um, all women blame their period for shit. You know what? Yes, some women do. But having dealt with this crap and this feeling and this awful for like most of my life this is not something that i would a wish on anyone or would want to be like on a regular basis oh okay that's my roommate using the, the blender apparently i don't know if you guys can hear that or what but yeah but anyway um basically it's like let me see if i can explain it a bit for me it goes in different ways like um it can be like this really uh, I get like this blanket of feelings super super depressed and I don't feel like I want to get out of bed I feel like nothing is good in my life you know what I mean like I just get all these horrible feelings like everything bad that I've been thinking every insecurity it just comes rushing up and honestly I don't deal I, I do I try to avoid all I mean, I, I try to avoid drama no matter what, but I try to avoid drama extra when I'm like this. Because I'm like, I ain't got time for y'all foolishness. Literally. Like, people have no clue how easily your ass will get just, okay, 
If you look like drama, believe, especially around this time. Nope, not dealing with it. Um, on the flip side, then it's like things that would I would usually be able to just look past, just kind of annoy the shit out of me. Like, y'all understand, it's like this... It's like this annoying... Um, this cloud of, of frustration that comes over and I get really testy and I try to avoid being that way because it's not fair to the people around you um, but sometimes it at the same time you kind of feel like okay I'm making all these compromises to not make my not be this person not be mean or whatever then make compromises to help me out too you know don't be a dick <laughs> you know what I mean like because sometimes the people in your life just don't care either way and it's not that they don't care it's more like they're like well whatever meh you being a bitch and you know what I mean but like I feel like sometimes you, you do need a little extra help around this time it's a little like women that actually do deal with it and it's not a case and I know there are women who are much worse than I am you know and gosh I just so sorry for you guys but like like people who deal who, who have it like for real and like experience this crazy as hell hormonal shit it's not cool nobody wants to feel like this so any women who are out there doing it just for the sake of doing it that's stupid <laughs> because or just for the sake of like making their partners feel bad or treating them badly getting away with treating them badly that's garbage because the people that really go through this and this feeling you don't want to feel like this you don't want to feel like this no you don't want to feel like if life as you know it is just this crazy place that you want out of at least for that day you don't want to feel like that so yeah so don't do it anyway on to tomorrow i hope you guys have an amazing day whenever you see this i hope you're having an amazing day amazing night amazing whatever bye those guys are super cute. Rodents. Those are little white cute yeah, dogs. Like rodents. Are you recording? Oh shit. Yeah, paparazzi. <laughs> I thought it was a picture, so I actually was like, yo. Nah. Oh, you yeah. have Take me as well? Yeah. Alright. We can work out on the weekdays. Yeah. <laughs> Monday. Round two. Oh, yeah, it's true. For three of us. Round two for three of us. Joe, you gotta catch up, Joe. Only, only one smart person in the car right now. <laughs> My legs don't feel like that day, though. What'd you guys do today? I just. Did everybody do legs today? Yeah. Yeah, I did legs as well. Total, it was called sitting. It's a total body thing. I kinda of, like that. Well, last week was like great things. Today, being the first day of the weekend, I started by doing legs. Like, I tell, I, uh, I tell you, I, I come home from the gym and I, yeah, I told Joe, and I sleep, just like, not fuck Sleep sounds awesome. It was, it was. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know, I don't even know how I would manage it if I didn't go back to sleep. Uh, no. I think they were just shaking my hands. Who, the people in their yes. I mean, tell. their windows are tinted so we can barely see. Oh, I see.
And, and it's, it's got good light as well. I mean, the light is. I realize it's not that great, but it's picking it up real well. What? This is long enough. It's only been three minutes. Really? Yeah, it's usually signal. My boobs are like in the bad times now. Yeah, they grew in the last five seconds. They grew? Shut up. Shut up. Very sad. 